Hi to all. Welcome to our channel Tech Nokri India. Guys, we are actually new to the YouTube, so we are going to update all the notifications, the fresh notifications with respect to the government as well as private, especially majorly focusing on the government aspect to all our Indian nation people, especially who are preparing for electrical, electronics, mechanical, instrumentation and all other various branches like civil, chemical and other various branches. We are going to give you the complete information with respect to the latest notifications and related syllabus, cutoff and preparation strategy and the materials required and how you should prepare and what are the short tricks and the methods in cracking the examinations. So today we are making this video in order to bring into your notice about the recent notification about Bharat Electronics Limited organization has called for various engineer assistant trainee vacancies. This engineer assistant trainee vacancies are nothing but these are on diploma basis. If you have completed your engineering as well based on the diploma you are also eligible to apply for this and tomorrow is the last date for whoever is applying and there are various other notifications with respect to the EAT I mean to say uh, recently there are several notifications with respect to the EAT engineer assistant trainee notifications for various uh, branches of diploma in entire India and please do subscribe to our channel because we are going to give you the detailed syllabus which is required for preparation of this particular notes. Okay guys, here you are going to see the Bell recently announced a few of the notifications with respect to Chennai, Navi Mumbai, Pune, Karnataka as well as Ghaziabad. And in future, there will be many more notifications which are coming for engineer assistant trainee, especially for diploma holders. And there are overall 180 plus vacancies in all across these regions. And if you want to go through the detailed notification, please click on this website link. And I will post this link in the description box. And thereby you can see in the career session, there will be lot of vacancies with respect to the region wise. So now let us go deep dive into the pattern of this examination, how it is going to be prepared on a, the preparation of the paper, how they are going to do on, and on what basis. So I will be discussing specially for ECE, EEE as well as mechanical students. So now let us get deep into the Bell examination pattern, how it is going to happen. There will be two sessions guys. One is called as part one and another is called as part B, part two. So in part one, there will be completely a mental ability test like explaining about a general aptitude, mental ability, reasoning, analytical skills, comprehension, numeracy and data interpretation and GK, general knowledge. And the question number of questions which you need to face is 15 questions and you need to get 50 marks. This is bit tricky and I can say it is very easiest chapter except this GK. Okay, hope if you have prepared for various couple of examinations for uh, public services, then it will be very easy and whoever is currently updated with the current affairs is also very much helpful for attending this GK. And other than this, all of the sessions are very easy to crack and we can guide you such manner of how to solve the questions and in how quick you need to solve the attempt the questions and part b is completely a professional knowledge which is required in your discipline that is triple e electrical and electronics and electronics and communication and led branches and mechanical branch and even csc is also available that is computer science and you need to face 100 questions and 100 marks you need to score so totally it will be for 20, 150 marks and 150 questions and the exam duration also will be for 150 minutes and expected exam date for, that is for the recent notification is December 2025. So now let us go still further more deep into the particular topics. What all the syllabus we need to study? You know, if I have to crack this exam, then I need to go through each and every topic. So in general aptitude, these are the five topics which we discussed before. And in this specifically talking, you need to prepare 
these subjects you see average boards and streams compound interest simple interest data interpretation probability questions and problems on trends times and work percentage similarly there are various other units which you need to prepare and especially this sentence formation which is a paragraph paragraph based questions will be there in this itself you are going to get 10 marks out of 50 you are going to get out of 50 you are going to get 10 marks in this particular unit and this will be a sentence based like a paragraph they will give like a paragraph writing will be there and there will be a couple of questions like five questions per, per paragraph and you need to answer those five questions and it will be very easy to attend guys and we can guide you how to attend it and how to read and how to understand and how to crack this examination and coming towards the technical part so what is the major difficulty in facing technical yes technical is a very challenging part in all of the examinations especially for aspirants because we need to study a diploma of three years and some people might have completed even engineering plus three years but also still they face a struggling point in facing questions and in understanding the concepts because of the difficulty in the level of understanding or in the way they are getting the explanations but here if you have to crack this examination especially that 100 marks then you need to focus on these particular topics for electronics and for mechanical these are the topics and for electrical engineering these are the topics so very interesting what are the major questions you are going to get and from which topic that i can say the basics basics whichever subjects are there basic subjects from this itself you are going to get minimum 20 to 25 questions okay minimum 20 to 25 questions you are going to get from the basic topics which i am just sticking here okay yeah so very interesting and very important is now we have explained you about the detailed syllabus of what all the units you need to cover in your examination point of view and in coming days we will be explaining you about various other topics with respect to the electronics and electrical engineering and i will be teaching you all the classes in the youtube please do subscribe to our channel and stay tuned and be interactive with us because only then we can talk each other so that we can discuss a lot and we can solve many questions so that you can crack the examination very easily and if i have to say about a cracking this examination then you need to score a minimum of 110 to 130 marks out of 150 marks keep this in mind as a reminder guys as a reminder to score more so that you can select in the unreserved category itself no need to depends on any reservations okay and please do subscribe to our channel and click on the bell icon so that so that every notification whichever we post it you will be getting it on instant basis and if you if you have liked this video please do click on the like button and please do share it with all of your friends and colleagues and then if you need any more information please do comment guys i will be very happy to answer to all of your comments and that's it i hope i have delivered a very good information with respect to that detailed syllabus and if you need any further information please do comment in the comment box so that i will be coming prepared so that i can prepare you guys so i wish you all the best guys see you in the next session good day take care Bye.